All right. Got it. Rundown. It is uh, March something. Twenty six. Yep. Who cares? Who matter. cares? Um, we'll start with uh, Cheesecake Factory, and and they told their so Cheesecake told their landlords they're not paying. Kind of a and I've said this. It's Cheesecake. I saw the letter or what the CEO said. It wasn't as bad as they make it sounds like. We've had this long relationship. Can we work something out? But whatever. The news reported they will not pay. And then this is right off the heels of Balls, the Wolf of Ball Street, having his pick of his day. Now, I will say it bounced back pretty nice today somehow. Um, but amazing how Glenny Balls picks one stock, and it's like the number one trend basically on Twitter an hour later. This guy, he's in basement, no shirt. He's giving out the stocks. I mean, that's that's the, the Dave Portnoy deal with the devil with content, right? I mean, what are the chances that's in the news and then that becomes a funny clip and everybody watches it? See, like, one in a trillion out of every company in the world that Glenny could have picked, that's the one? I'm trying to get the ebbs and yes. flows, and then I got three million knuckleheads saying, I told you to do this, I told you to do that, and I'm just dependent on my fat guy. I glenny balls. He says when lunchtime hits, people get hungry. So Where are you, Kevin? I'm in a tent. I'm in a, a indoor fort. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, uh, I'm sure you guys talked about it earlier, but nah, did nah. you not no, talk I about it? I didn't even thing? notice. I, didn't yeah, I was like, is he? Sense. I thought he was in a shower for a second. Why? Yeah. yeah now that you say it, why? <laughs> it's unbelievable. I got like a beanbag chair set up. Why? I got a pan in here. I don't know. I'm just trying to fucking. I'm, otherwise, I'm just sitting on my kitchen uh, kitchen table chairs, and it's, it's miserable up there. So you just made yourself a fort? Yeah. But just for yourself? Like you're eight yeah. years old? Well, I mean, I got kids, and then uh, I, I, I put they, it up them, and I'm just hanging out in it. It's great. Do they like the fort? Yeah. Who doesn't like a fort? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. <laughs> How do we... Dave is so about himself that he didn't even notice you're in a fucking fort. You know yeah. why, Dan? Because this is the background. <laughs> so oh, you can't even see us? Oh, oh, yeah. yeah. You're just looking at your terminal. Dan, yeah. Dan you missed the, the best Michelangelo small talk before you came in. Michelangelo goes, I, I think my roommate has corona. And Dave goes, yeah, yeah, that's great. Whatever. Can you get Dan on the phone? Like, just <laughs> like, so Michael Angelo, uh, to his credit, like he's not even trying to be funny. Like he thinks I give an absolute fuck or any of us do about anything he does or his life or his existence at all. Yeah. Yeah. But I Michael also, Angelo, I could care less if you have it, Corona. I don't care if you have like eight. I just do the thing. My, Michael Angelo, have you even been in the office? Michelangelo, uh, have yeah, you ever? Yes, yes, I have been. I was there for about how many three weeks before uh, all this went down. Where did you sit? Uh, in the equipment room with all of the cameras, it's camped out in there. Oh, okay. So that's like, yeah, that's like not even that's not even a real room. No, no Michelangelo's no. come out of nowhere, just making <laughs> small talk like he. I've known him for fucking two decades. I think my roommate has coronavirus. All right, that's good. Now, can we get Dan on the phone? Well, my roommate was coughing while I. Nobody said cares, it. Michelangelo. <laughs> that's fair. I might not like be when able there's to do this not, much longer. The first thing you should say at all times when two of the three people are on this is, "Let me go find where the third person is." Not, "Hey, my guy's coughing. I may have like." No one cares. Okay. Right. He, he's probably going to die anyway, so I'll be living. See, that's life. what I mean. Nobody cares, <laughs> Michael Angelo. Nobody cares. Like, nobody cares. All right, I'm tapping out. I'm tapping out. All right, good. Um, in Montana was interviewed. Wait, did he get tested, Michael Angelo? Uh, he has not been tested yet. <laughs> Dude, shut up. I was doing that oh. to fuck with you. Go back away. <laughs> I need it. I have this open order. I can't Michael really Angelo. for that. <laughs> oh my, he's like, I don't know where he came. That's like today. So people are delivering. Oh, you guys are the only two people, I think, in the world. who. Where's Dan? Where did he go? Oh, yeah, where did I go? Click your oh, here. Uh, I'm back, I'm back. I I, uh, I meant to mention that. I, I ordered uh, lunch today via Grubhub. Is that what you are going to say? Grubhub, yes. Let's do the Grubhub ad. Um, Barstool's. 
Yep, Barstool Best Bar Tournament is the only tournament with this March. It's coming out of the wire. Elite Eight finished up today. We're headed to the final four this weekend. Best Bar Tournament is delivered by Grubhub. They've been a huge part of this tournament's success. Not only has Grubhub been an awesome sponsor, they've been looking, uh, hooking our followers up with discount codes for money, everything else. So get in the Grubhub. Uh, Grubhub is dedicated to helping out local restaurants, delivery workers to keep their businesses alive. Support the cause. Make sure to order from Grubhub. A lot of choices. Pick Grubhub. You can keep up the latest bracket for Barcelona's best bar by heading to the fifth year Twitter account. Go vote and be part of the action. I was going to say, I had something that only you two would appreciate, really. I did this my full pizza review, a big one, because they were hinted at yesterday, and I just didn't record it. Oh, you have it on the whiteboard right behind you. Oh. Oh, I, do it. I do it at the table. Uh, yeah, yeah. And I didn't redo it. It was like I already had a half eaten slice. Like Ugh. when I went to shut it off, I was like, wait a minute. I never. And so I, it, it's the worst one. It just sucks. By the way, text me your address. We're back into the old school days where the only time we communicate is through the rundown and you just don't respond to texts or emails. Text me your address. I have people who want to send you free frozen pizza. No, Dan, that's exactly my next point. I, I, the fact. Oh, okay. I'm I, happy I brought that up. Yeah, because I don't like giving out my address, but I've been reluctantly doing it because people are asking me to do it's someone pizza. I trust. That's not so like- today. Just for t- I'm working my dick off. Just for 20 minutes, I went up to I took my shirt off. It's 57 degrees. Get some glow on my roof deck. These two fucking idiots co- somehow made it onto my roof deck with pizza. They're like, "Hey, what should we do with this pizza?" I was like, "What are you assholes doing?" Oh my God. Oh my God! Uh, like in your building roof? Yes. <sighs> That's what is why going I'm not giving. On? The, they, they but Dave, I'm me. giving. All right, fine. I'll fucking have it delivered to my place, and then I'll bring it to you. I don't care. It's, yeah. it's every fine, but everybody wants. To, if, if one person can't, I told them the address. I gave it. It's coming from it. Chicago, though. It's not. It's not someone's got. Not, someone's not gonna fly from Chicago and and drop it off at your house. They're gonna. They're gonna fucking mail it. You drop it in the lobby like I've done it ten with these two idiots. Now I'm not gonna do their pizza. I'm not gonna. No, I definitely don't. Don't no, definitely I, don't. That's now, a now, fucking let me huge tell, breach of privacy. Let me tell the whole story. I they asked. I gave them the address and just a drop, and that was it. And that's what everyone's been doing. They drop it in the lobby with the packages. For these two to wiggle their way through the elevator into the roof deck, unbelievable. And I have my shirt off. Listen to me for five minutes. It's like, what the fuck are you two doing? What you did, you, did, you kick him out? did you yell at him? Yeah, I kicked him out. Yeah, gave I'll it to read him. you the email. I'll, I'll, I sent him an email right now. I'll show you the email. Uh, let's see. It, it, here's the email I sent them. Now you ruined it for everyone else, guys. Dave won't respond to my text yeah. because of you. Yeah. It, it, uh, I, they said item left in lobby after I yelled at him. I go, are you guys insane? Why would you ever enter the building and come to the roof? Every other place has done the same thing. Dropped it off. This is why I don't get up, give out my info. They ruined it. Yeah. They ruined it. I would they fucking hate you. If I was your neighbors or some shit, you're letting these fucking jamokes come in? Well, most of the people have just dropped it. There's, there's packages everywhere in my lobby. That's how it is. You just drop, you, like You can't miss the packages. They're there. These fucking two clowns. You go on the roof deck, I have five minutes of peace, and I'm getting a glow on, and you... No. That's Um, scary. Yeah. Where am I at with this stock that... No, Grubhub. Fuck it. I should have sold my... My favorite restaurant from uh, my hometown I ordered from. I got to keep them in business. Grubhub's trying to keep everybody in business. Yes, absolutely. (laughs) Uh, MVMT watches... Uh, MVMT watches, MVMT watches, MVMT watches, MVMT watches. Uh, no, what I don't know what you're doing right now. Yeah, we never really did the Grubhub ad. I just yeah, did you the just, Grubhub you ad. You just said Grubhub, you just said the word Grubhub. You acknowledge there was an ad. What are you talking about? <laughs> I, did I just leave Earth? Yeah, and Kevin and I are sitting here being like, "Hey, dude, yeah, can I do hey, the promo bad." What are you talking about? Like you didn't. What do did like you the read part yes. of it? Yes, I what, did. Like okay, so what did you say? Counting shit. Yeah, what did you say, Dave? What did you say about the Grubhub? I said the best bar tournament. 
Did you? See? You did not. What are you well, talking about? Started to, but then, but then you started. You went off, but, uh, yeah, I read like, the whole fucking thing. You okay. did not read the whole thing. I read the whole fucking thing. Michael Where are you two been? That Michael shows Angelo, you why we've had I all mean, these issues. This you, is why we can't Michael do Angelo. Skype because you guys tune me out and then make me seem like a madman. That I read might the be whole. True. You read yeah, the whole thing. Yeah, that is true. I read the whole Michael fucking Angelo. thing. Did he read the whole thing? Michelangelo. Now I feel like this is another ah, uh, another test. Okay, yeah. Get out of here. No, you stay Michelangelo. Don't just answer did I read it. What? It was, I, I didn't hear is there any sort of, if there's a code or something I didn't hear any code. That's all. I read the whole fucking app. Okay. Okay. Did he Michelangelo? <laughs> Dan asked you a question Michelangelo. What the fuck? <laughs> Partial, partial read. Get the fuck out of here. What do you mean, partial, partial read, read, Michelangelo? Partial. He said partial. See? What? You didn't do the whole thing. Now my email's fucking... I did. Grubhub, yes. Let's do the Grubhub ad. Um, Barstool's... Shit. Yep, Barstool Best Bar Tournament is the only tournament with this March. It's coming out of the wire. Elite Eight finished up today. We're headed to the final four this weekend. Best Bar Tournament is delivered by Grubhub. They've been a huge part of this tournament's success. Not only has Grubhub been an awesome sponsor, they've been looking, uh, hooking our followers up with discount codes for money, everything else. So get into Grubhub. Uh, Grubhub is dedicated to helping out local restaurants, delivery workers to keep their businesses alive. Support the cause. Make sure to order from Grubhub. A lot of choices. Pick Grubhub. You can keep up the latest bracket for Barstool's Best Bar by heading to the fifth year Twitter account. Go vote and be part of the action. I there did. Is no chance you read this entire thing. I'm looking at it right now. Read it. Okay. I'm going to read the whole thing. Yeah, read it. Okay. Add one, add read one. The rundown is delivered by Grubhub. The Barstool Best Bar Tournament is the only tournament we had this March, and it's coming down to the wire. The Elite Eight finished up today, and we're headed to, into the Final Four this weekend. The Best Bar Tournament is delivered by Grubhub, and they have been a huge part of this tournament's success. You did not read this. I said they butchered <laughs> sure been a huge part of the success. Not only has Grubhub been an awesome sponsor to us, but Set they've it. hooked up our followers with discount codes for money off their Set order it. every round of the tournament. Grubhub is dedicated to helping out local restaurants. Set it. Every no work way. Their business no way. Yeah, I fucking did. No from way. Grubhub. You can keep up with the latest bracket for Barstool's Best Bar by heading to fifth year for uh, on Twitter. 100% read the, the whole page. motherfucking thing. Go visit Grubhub <laughs> right now. And check out Grubhub, where they are hosting the best bar, Barstool's best bar tournament, and order with Grubhub. They have the best deals out there. I read the whole fucking thing, pretty much. Wow, well, the last sentence I made up, you fucking loser. I didn't know the last sentence. Yeah. That's why I said pretty much. That's yeah. why I said pretty much. <laughs> I said pretty much. I was like, maybe I didn't read that line. All right. Kevin just got dark. Uh, where's Rachel? MVMT watches. How else would I know that's fucking it? Oh, you guys don't apologize for dick. I read the whole fucking thing. Michael Angel well, said I was also laughing. I was also laughing because movement watches is specifically said not to say MVMT, and you said it like 60,000 times. I was trying to find it. Now it's time to move on to our all-time favorite underdog story. Movement watches. Movement watches found the police and stylish and Two million watches worldwide by bringing quality designs at fair prices. Everyone loves a ground up entrepreneur story movement. Was started by college dropouts as a crowd, but started living on type up because they lived it too. Why move watches just start nine bucks? Normally you look at four hundred, the same quality brand. We're always wearing movement around head headquarters. So nice to have a simple watch that just tells time looks good. Movement not only offers watches, they have sunglasses, other accessories, perfect gifts for friends and others. Join the movement, get 15% off with free shipping events. MVMT.com slash rundown. Movement slots and new styles on the site all the time. Check out the latest MVMT.com slash rundown. Join the movement. I will say, we you, you missed, you missed of, some uh, words. You missed uh, some words. A lot of advertisers right now. They're pulling money, but are tight. So we do appreciate your gift. Get MVMT. We do appreciate you. Use Grubhub because they're sticking by us when a lot of people don't know what to do. So support them. Um, Dana White. Robbie had Dana. Wow. Brady Montana. Did you see that interview at all? So. No. Wait. So Montana was interviewed about Brady. 
And he basically said Brady wanted so much control. That's the main reason, which I'm fine with. He's like, he wanted to pick the receivers, the plays, everything. That's all I got on that. Um, Dana White and Robbie. Robbie, good interview. Uh, some MMA guys get mad at Robbie because he's friends with Dana. But Dana, this was like a soundbite. He's giving the double birds to the fucking camera, being like, fuck the media, fuck this, fuck Corona, we're having this fight. I don't give a fuck. I'm not do telling you know, the though, media. Do you have the location? I, Is it set? One I place? know. Every, I'm not telling the media anything. Fuck <laughs> them. I'm not telling them anything, okay? Pretty good clip from uh, Dana White, and I'm excited for this fight. Yeah. When is it? It's like April 8th, isn't it? I'm excited now. I mean, that's like, listen, that's the only sporting event you can watch right now. It's going to be the biggest fucking thing in the world. It's a great job by them. Yeah. That also yeah. should be a viral clip of him, like, doing the double birds and going bananas. I don't know why they can't just test everyone. Like, I know it sounds stupid, but, like, why can't we just – I feel like the entire NBA has been tested. Yeah, that's – the NBA got tested, like, quickly. Did I fuck up on Nike? I did. Fucking cunt-ass bitch. Mm. What happened? It, it's, it's Nike. I really – 40 minutes. We had uh, – Whitney and I were talking. I had him on Stock Central today. And the perfect analogy for the last, like, 20 minutes of the stock market is essentially it's a shorthand it, – it's a power play – end of the game, pull the goalie, and the ref's not blowing whistles. Oh. Like, that essentially, it's just chaos for the, like, Figure it out game. on the ice. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Um, Arianda Grande, your your girl, KFC, all the way back to Tico, Texas days, is now dating a real estate agent. I don't know. You got any thoughts? He kind of looks, like, a little bit like Pete Davidson. I mean, I, I don't know. I feel like she's a megastar to be dating, like, a is he like a hotshot real estate agent? Is he like he must be probably right to like the millionaires? So I guess that makes sense. But yeah. I mean, he looks just like an average fucking Joe. It's like Miranda Kerr when she went with the Snapchat guy Siegel. Well, that yeah, guy's he, a billionaire. Maybe yeah, it's a million not. dollar listing. What was the guy Chad Michael Michaels? No, yeah. Chad Rogers. He's Chad we Rogers. still DM like once every eight months. He is ripped to shreds. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ripped. And then, Dan, I'm glad you put this out because it, it was probably the most laugh-out-loud moment of Tiger King is when that dude is on the jet ski and nobody has been, like, more proud of themselves in the history of, really, cinema than that guy was, like, just tearing it up on his jet ski. And the best part was he was, like, they did the jet ski montage and he was, like, yeah, I snitched. I might snitch again. Like, he... <laughs> Like, he's addicted to snitching, and it's a fucking documentary about tigers, and it's like, all right, let's do the jet ski scene. It was crazy. <laughs> it came out of nowhere. It's brilliant. The director knew what he was doing at all times. <laughs> By the way, speaking of, like, documentaries, and Gaz fell into this, like, what are the thoughts now on people acting like documentaries that are old or new? Like, the OJ thing. Like, People being like, I can't believe you guys aren't live tweeting the OJ thing. And Gaz, like, talking like it's new. It's like, that's very old. Yeah, but Gaz goes to bed at, like, 8 p.m. So anytime True. they're showing shows now that he probably didn't miss the first time around, he's like, holy shit, OJ did this? Whoa. Yeah, good point. Good point. I what does Gaz, with... what, what Gaz do? Is Gaz, are Gaz and fights in the same? Yeah. No, they Gaz live together? Somewhere. Oh, he's Gaz is in New York. probably in, like, New Hampshire or something. Yeah. Oh. I didn't know. That. I thought he was in New York. I didn't know that. Maybe um, any post show or anything? This sucks. It's good. I think we got a long way to go. Even though I think I think we're gonna find out that it it the fear outweighed the actual when we all when it's all said and done like that it, it's not as damaging as we think it. We're gonna be out. And healthy. I saw an article. Oh, it's Fossey, your guy. He said what I've basically been saying to a degree that this is going to be a new flu. He's like, it's never going to be gone. There'll be, it'll keep coming back seasonally, aka the flu. Right. And we'll have a vaccine, obviously, at some point, which makes it, you know, that you can get the vaccine and not feel still people are dying, and whatnot. But it, I think we kind of know what we're dealing with right now, and other countries are coming out of it, and we will too. Are they, though? China kind of did, right? I don't don't trust China at all. Yeah. Yeah. Once Italy figures some shit out, then I feel like 
We're just like right behind Italy, right? Everything that happens in Italy has been happening to us. I'm I'm at the point where I need I need them to transition to be like I need them to pat pat me on my ass. I need them to be like good job at a boy. Like this social distancing stuff is working. Less yeah. people are dying. Well, like they don't do that yet. They yeah. just keep so saying York, how bad one of the New York one of the New York guys, I don't know which one said it is slowing down. So the distancing is okay. starting to work, but he wasn't like you know, it's a catch twenty two. If you say, Hey, it's working, people may flood the streets again. There's, right, there, but I, there was a doctor in Chicago that said, like, when we come out of this, you're gonna feel like we did it all for nothing. But that's the point: is that right. it should feel like nothing. So, all right, I got about 20, 35 minutes now to get into this fucking. I can tell by so I'm up 178 grand today, but the market's way up again, um, and that's where we're at. Are you? Uh, what are you heavy on right now? Nike, 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 Nike. 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 Thank you. All right. Bye, uh, about, uh, real quick, right. uh, Donker yeah. selling Barstool.com to the Minifans. fans. Is he? I saw that. Yeah. I, I like. Who cares? It like it redirects to not even the Minif- not even Minahan show. Like one of his like secondary shows. Good. That means all right. I, it's tough to get a read on that guy. I don't know whether he hates me, likes me, whatever. But I did definitely want Barstool.com. I don't think it would make much of a difference nowadays. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Later. All right. Later, later guys.